Hi, I'm Abby at Two Wheel Centre and today we're going to take a look at the new HJC IS17 helmet. This is a great little addition to the HJC range, it's a sports touring helmet, uh, entry level but really equally suited to a commuting so if you ride to work every day this could be a helmet that's of interest to you. The HJC IS17 has a polycarbonate shell. Um, this uh, also makes use of HJC's wind tunnel technology. Um, HJC are just one of the few manufacturers that do have a wind tunnel at their disposal to, uh, to put into their designs of their helmets. So that comes across in all the HJC helmets, including the IS17. To the top of the helmet, you've got an easy to operate uh, two point uh, intake vent and also to the chin as well, a nice easy to operate with your gloves on chin vent. To the rear of the helmet are uh, vents to the sides and also to the top uh, integrated into the helmet again for that really smooth airflow as you ride. The main uh, feature of the IS-17 which is uh, worth mentioning is the internal sun visor that is built in to the helmet just here. Now this operates by a simple push down lever central of the center of the helmet so really easy to operate with either hand as you require it um, but also what's really nice about this is the release system a simple button on the top of the helmet releases the visor but it's a really nice soft release you don't have to manually put it pull it back like you did with some of the uh, earlier sun visors it manages itself and it's really soft back into the helmet as well also worth mentioning is that this sun visor is two points so you can customize it to yourself if you want it just uh, fully down you can take it to this point or if you wanted it halfway down just to here so that really allows if you feel like you might need a bit more space around your nose you can either have it in this position or further down if you so want it the outer visor of the IS-17 is definitely worth having a look at as well. This is operated firstly by a simple locking mechanism on the bottom, so if you do any lifesaver checks as you're riding to work, I should hope that you will, um, you, uh, this, the visor isn't going to fly up at all, it's locked into place. But it's really, easy, really easily released just by this simple lock me mechanism here. Take the visor up and you'll notice that it's got HJC's rapid fire visor release system here. Now this is a really clever design, just pull a lever and the visor pops off and here as well pops the visor off this is a 2d optically correct visor and you'll notice as well it's got this recess in it now this recess is for the pinlock max vision anti-fog insert which is included with this uh, the anti-fog insert the, the max vision it's got maximum aperture of the visor this is um, a really really full coverage of the visor to allow for no uh, no fogging in certain parts with some of the original pin locks you would find that there were certain points of the visor that would still fog and usually there were very important points across the top maybe when you were riding low not the case with the max vision insert it's full maximum aperture and it's recessed into the visor to ensure you get this really good seal that's a really reliable good seal so that's included with the is17 as well i will also mention just on on this note that when you do go to fit the pin lock make sure you take off the uh, film which is on there um, sometimes uh, you, you might accidentally forget about that you find you've got a yellow tint and your vision is not quite so as anti-fog as you might have liked to fit the visor back on simply line up with the helmet pop it into place on each side like so really easy and you're good to go the internal liners of the IS-17 are fully removable as well if we look at the helmet from here, you can see there's a chin curtain, first of all. That's really easy to pop off. This stops fast flowing air going up into the helmet, although being a sports touring type helmet or commuting type helmet, you might not be going as fast as you might do with some of the, uh, the higher-end race helmets. But still, this feature is there. Really nice, especially handy if maybe you wear contact lenses and you don't want fast flowing air um, going up into the helmet and causing you irritation. So we're on removable chin curtain. The uh, cheek pads of the IS-17, um, these are also fully removable and washable, as is the um, top liner, which we'll come to shortly. This material here is what's called silver cool. This is a micro-wicking uh, antibacterial material, um, which allows you to keep your helmet nice and hygienic, but again, wash them, hand wash them, let them dry naturally, and you can keep your helmet cleaner for longer. I'll just take the other side out here for ease. like so it looks brutal it's not 
and also we've got here the removable school cap which is on a catch system at the front of the helmet and you just need to pop it out of there like so. Now what's worth noting about this school cap is that there's very few seams in there and uh, some nice soft padding so that's really comfortable as with the cheap pads as well straight out of the box it really fits quite quite lovely this helmet does. Now inter internally the helmet's got this EPS liner now that's the main shock absorption uh, within the helmet that's fun the function of that EPS liner is to absorb impacts so that's all the way around the helmet uh, really good coverage there um, for your for your head and you'll also notice that within the helmet where the vent holes are there are channels that run through the EPS liner now these are there for a very specific reason that's to channel cool air that comes into the helmet really nice and close to your head before they get pulled out through the rear intake vents so um, that's, a, that's a really nice feature of the IS-17, uh, that ventilation system. Again, it derives from HJC's wind tunnel technology. They really make the use of that air that's flowing over your head. Finally, the IS-17 is secured by a um, double D-ring fastening. This is uh, by far probably the most popular fastening system still, despite seat belt and ratchet strap fastening systems being on the market. And you'll also notice here that there is a... Um, a, a, a tab so that for easy release of the chin strap when you go to take the helmet off. So overall the IS-17 is a great lid if you are looking sports touring or maybe commuting this is the helmet for you it's at a great price point as well with that internal sun visor which is really easy to operate manages itself back into the helmet a really good design from HJC we anticipate that this will be a very popular helmet they're available now. Uh, you can purchase online at our website www.twowheel.co.uk or you can call us if you want to have a chat about the helmet some more on 01623 627 600.